Alexa, and I'll be reading from Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. You never told him? Never told him what was in the letter Dumbledore left for him? I was there. I saw Dumbledore leave it, Dursley, and you've kept it from him all these years? Keep what from me, said Harry eagerly. Stop! I forbid you, yelled Uncle Vernon in panic. Aunt Petunia gave a gap of horror. Ah, go boil your heads, both of you, said Hagrid. Harry, you're a wizard. There was a silence inside the hut. Only the sea and the whistling wind could be heard. I'm a what? gasped Harry. A wizard, of course, said Hagrid, sitting back down on the sofa, which groaned and sank even lower. And a thumping good one, too, I'd say, once you've been trained up a bit. With a mom and a dad like yours, what else would you be? And I reckon it's about time you read your letter. Harry stretched out his hand at last to take the yellowish envelope addressed in emerald green to Mr. H. Potter, the floor, hut on the rock of the sea. He pulled out the letter and read. The reason Harry Potter is a book that should not be banned is because it allows the reader to enter an entirely different world from which they are currently living in. The plotline of the series is very well written, and the reader should know that all of the events in the book are make-believe. It lets the reader's imagination run free. Without this book, or any fantasy book at all, the imagination of children would be so much more limited. 